I'm Leo Armstrong. This is taking it to the streets. Democrats in Congress are racing to meet a mid-March deadline for President Biden's coronavirus relief package before existing benefits expire. The package includes $1,400 checks for individuals with income below $75,000 a year, along with other financial aid for low-income workers. This week, we hit the streets of downtown Northampton to hear people's perspectives on the stimulus package that is currently making its way through Congress. Do you think it's been taking too long for these stimulus checks to be come out? Yes, yeah, because they are people who really, really do need them that are hurting out there. Why do you think it's been taking too long? <laughs> uh, probably politics. Do you believe that the stimulus checks go far enough in helping those during the pandemic? I don't think they go far enough. I think they help, but I think people need a lot, a lot more. Why is that? I just feel like a lot of people are struggling. A lot of people are, um, you know, the poverty level is going higher. And um, I just think I just think people need a lot of help right now. What is your opinion on the Democrats not prioritizing bipartisan support on this bill? I think since a lot of them ran their campaign on supporting it, it's hypocritical. I think it's annoying because there's a lot of people out there who really need help. And they're they're using a lot of the money for like military stuff and stuff that I don't personally think we need to be spending that much money on. Um, I think they should prioritize people who are struggling. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.